Potential Difference Research Lab. Uh, we're introducing the electric vehicle regenerative acceleration technology in this video. The EV regenerative acceleration innovation allows electric vehicles to recharge themselves as they drive and uh, in regenerative acceleration mode above 30 kilometers an hour and in regenerative acceleration mode when electric power is sent to the EV's batteries the regenerative acceleration innovation accelerates the EV above 30 kilometers an hour and the more power sent to the EV's batteries the more the EV is accelerated and below 30 kilometers an hour when the below 30 kilometers an hour the EV regenerative acceleration innovation operates as a conventional uh, EV regenerative braking system and decelerates the EV while it's recharging the batteries. So we'll move up and we'll get a closer look at the, the current going to the battery. system will increase. So let's take it up to 30 kilometers an hour.
system. So the regenerative acceleration, the EV regenerative acceleration innovation allows electric vehicles to be, begin recharging their own batteries beginning at 30 kilometers an hour and the more power that's sent to the batteries in regenerative acceleration mode, the more the batteries are recharged, the faster the EV, the more the EV is accelerated and the less plug-in recharging is required. When the EV is operating below 30 kilometers an hour, the regenerative acceleration innovation operates like any other uh, conventional regenerative braking system and decelerates the EV uh, when recharging the batteries. The next phase of development for the regenerative acceleration innovation is to integrate it into a hub motor, as you see here. And for the regenerative acceleration innovation to be fully integrated into an electric vehicle um, as a traction motor which allows for regenerative acceleration above 30 kilometers an hour and regenerative braking below 30 kilometers an hour. Thank you for taking the time to watch this video. Cheers.